Someone very aptly said, to err is human and to forgive is divine. As business analysts, we are constantly challenged with our user behaviors and it's very common for users to make mistakes. And it's very hard to correct their behavior because the number of users are very large um, and behaviors do take time to change and sometimes they don't change as well. So in this short video, what we are trying to describe all business analysts is the top three mistakes that users perform. This is as per our experience in dealing with probably about 10,000 users for our product. And what can we do to avoid such errors in our application? So let's start with the very first one, which is the most common one for me as well. I tend to forget user passwords or my credentials. Today we have hundreds or probably thousands of applications that we are dealing with and it's not possible to remember each and every password. We have banking system, we have grocery stores, um, we have Uber, we have so many applications that we are using. It's very, very common to forget password. And it's obviously an user irritation as well. So what can we do as BAs? One, provide an option to reset the password much easily. Maybe use their mobile phone and give them an instant password instead of asking them to remember password. Wherever possible, try to integrate with uh, say Google sign in or LinkedIn sign in so that they don't have to remember a special password for our application. Let's take a look at the second one. Second one is again extremely common, which is accidental deletion. The user did not wish to delete, but by mistake, they press the delete button and the data is gone. This is again another very, very common event that you might have experienced as a VA. So few things that we can do. One, to keep the delete button sufficiently away from other buttons. So that it kind of distinguishes itself saying that it's a transaction which is to be used with caution. Then of course, prompt before deletion. This is something which is a must and do not put the button again on yes, saying confirm yes. Then they will again confirm yes. So please put the cursor on no so that they typically come out of that deletion option. Third, key provision for recovery wherever possible so that the user can recover the transaction in case they have deleted the transaction. Fourth, you could also consider restricting the deletion access to few roles so that not everybody can delete sensitive or useful information. The third one is forgetting stuff. It's again extremely common for users to remember something after they completed the transaction or even submitted their transaction. Many of you might have observed that you ordered some items on a shopping cart or a portal. Then you forgot, oh, I forgot two more items. So what do we do? We should allow changes to transaction till the very last moment possible. So this is something which can be helpful for users. And again, allow linking transactions so that um, in case there are two transactions which need to be merged, the user has the provision to merge them. Before you leave the uh, video, don't forget to grab your free copy of 108 BA Techniques by registering free at succeed.net. With succeed.net, you also get lots of other interesting BA stuff. Thanks for watching. Bye.